Hello, welcome to my channel. My name is Aziza. I'm reading today for the sign of uh, Scorpio for January 2020 for love and relationship. Scorpio, you, you are looking ahead to the future here. You are seeking, like, you know, really a future with the person. Some of you are looking at wed wedding dresses, like, you know, I see the, you know, the veil and I see the wedding dress. There is a good uh, communications at your work at this time. It feels to you like you know, that you are getting ahead with your work. Um, there is uh, like you know, your business is going to be getting stronger. It's really uh, going up really so high, very fast, very quick. There is a speed in it also. You will move faster like you know, with luck, so much luck. And I get here that it will cover or recover, like, you know, all of this, like, you know, finances or losses that you had in the past. Another person in a relationship, I get here that uh, they have been really, like, you know, acting, maybe some of you, some of them acting like a child. Or they wanted to be, like, you know, uh, being young. And uh, they wanted to just, like, you know, to party and drink and doing all of that. But lately, they have been really trying to see, like, you know, okay, this is it, you know? Enough of enough. I'm not really, like, you know, trying to party anymore or be that type of person, like, you know, that um, a child anymore. Because something like you know, to do with possibly indulging alcohol or something that is really getting to their system and they are not really feeling good about it themselves. And some of them, like, you know, have been throwing up also from alcohol. And they need to look into their health more. You are worried about this person's health. They are going to be okay. So don't worry, okay? This person in relationship, like, you know, that um, they, they want, like, you know, to fulfill your wishes. And they feel, like, you know, that you need, uh, like, like, they are getting more serious in the relationship with you. And they, they you need, like, you know, more money or for them to provide money or to give money more. And they find themselves like, you know, that they are not being able to give you exactly what you want. And uh, they feel like, you know, they disappoint you because it has been your work and effort all the time here. So this person, like, you know, they are undecided back and forth what to do. And you feel like, no, okay, we are in a relationship. Like, no, who, who cares? You know, just don't worry about it. You know, I'm tough enough for it. They don't want you to be tough enough for it. This person like you know, that. They want to be tough enough for it themselves. But you feel like, you know, okay, I'm going to leave it alone. They commit to it or no. I don't care if they commit to it or not. We are family. We are together. This person keep really like, you know, going really out or away or on trips all the time. But you kind of like start to be worried here. You start to be worried because this person is like, you know, okay, we are up to commitment, relationship, perhaps marriage. My partner just get divorced or uh, separated from another person. This relationship between us should get ahead. And where is he or she at? Why they keep leaving and going on trips here and there and they are not paying attention to this relationship now you are kind of like starting to be mad. Okay, I'm for it. What happened? They see you like, you know, really tough enough. That's why they leave you be. And they don't pay attention. Actually, they are happy with this relationship. They are up to the marriage and everything. But it's making you worried. Why this person is partying in the time that I need him or her to be next to me? 
or beside me to work on things because you are all over your head like you know, with this settling down with the relationship because you think way ahead about this relationship settling down into like you no know, growing up more and more and you want everything like you know, so fast um they tell you here take it easy whatever you want even if you want it next month it's gonna happen stop worrying you worry a lot just stop worrying it will happen it just don't panic okay One of you is really thinking about really like you no know, hiring a private investigator here like you no know, for your person because you are worried that they are not really being truthful with you at this time and you feel like you no know, okay if this i will destroy it i know that i worked hard enough for that relationship no matter what i did i don't care i need to find out why my person keep traveling and go all of these trips and you feel like you know, there is something something like you no know, sneaky or fishy going on it's kind of like another area and another area you want to find out like you no know, is this like you no know, person like you no know, having a different relationship somewhere else your person really truly love you they care for you i'm not getting this person is doing something really different or being sneaky they are just worried about how to handle situations because they they their their life is not in balance like you know just um, uh, they are lacking like you know work money finances here they haven't been working it could be like you know a settlement or something they have been waiting for also from uh, um any situation like you know, it could be like you know just something happened in the past and they wanted a settlement for it they need money and the money situation here the loss of money see it's making this person go away like you know, just in, instead of really working on their finances they want to be free they want to be happy they want to party instead of like you know just sitting there and think what they want to do they say i don't want to deal with it i don't want to think about it i just want to go and you think maybe they are up to an, a different relationship or someone else you need to stop worrying there is not nobody else it looks to me that your person aware of the issue and the problem financially and they need to provide and um, they run away from their problems instead of facing it and that is what's going on there. Because they know that this is a settled down relationship and which is you don't need anything from this person to do, but they haven't been committed or reliable for you at that time and they want to know what to do. So they have been moody back and forth about staying next to you or at home they just want to go out you are going to be really making everything is peaceful and you are going to come to an agreement or understanding with your person because i see a chat or you're gonna talk to each other about too many things because the other person even when you talk to them they don't really talk much like you know they tell you stop worrying about things that's the only thing that you hear from them they don't really do much to make you feel um having that security that everything is fine because you doubt every action this other person doing is making you afraid to continue with this person You are hoping that the marriage will happen like because you are uh, this person like me said okay we are together but you want an actual marriage is this marriage going to happen or not it's happening i'm not getting that it's going to have the marriage will happen as soon as uh, possible or so fast <clears throat> but there is a definite move forward in this relationship i don't see you discontinuing with it 
you're gonna keep moving forward with this person the only thing that you need to isolate like you know anything really bad because this person who is with you they did isolate some of you marriage or another relationship and they want to be with you so they are coming through with things you need just to stop worrying because everything is working but the suspicions is so big about your person right now because they never vent or talk about things like no seriously to you that's why everything seems like a suspicions suspicion so rest assured like you know that at the end there is a really big happy family here between you and this person so they are not going anywhere without you well dear scorpio i hope you enjoyed the reading and uh, um, if you need a private reading, please contact me on mysticalaziza.com and email me directly on aziza at mysticalaziza.com. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.